Hey guys, I'm Kyoko. Welcome back to The Long Dark. The episode 3, Crossroads Elegy, has been finally released. And you guys can play the story mode, the episode 3 of the story mode, and you, you can play as Astrid. But, what we're gonna be doing this time around is not playing the story, because I don't want to spoil it for anybody. We're gonna go into survive mode and play the sandbox, the sandbox mode the way it was meant to be played, uh, because the Crossroads LG has reworked the Pleasant Valley map, one of my favorite maps and one of the maps that has ex existed in this game for quite a long time. It has now been reworked and revamped and I would like to go and check it out and see how it looks now and what is new and what is different. So, that's what we're gonna do, we're gonna go into survival mode, we're gonna start with a new one, we're gonna go with some custom settings over here, I have already set this up, uh, basically I made it somehow somewhere between interloper and stalker and voyager i don't know somewhere in between there's there's some things all the animals are on medium uh amount of them you know uh, that's okay if you want to see how it looks there's the code you can use that one we're gonna confirm that we're gonna go into pleasant valley we're gonna play as a lady and we're gonna go youtube accept how long can we survive boys I've been playing Project Zomboid lately, Project Zomboid that is pretty much the best survival games when it comes to survival game when it comes to zombies and I had uh, the itch to play the Long Dark again, Dark again, which is the best wilderness survival game. So it looks like we are in a cave, we start in a cave and it's very dark and I can't see anything in here. Very good. Do we have a light source? Let's go check it out. We do have one flare and we have some matches. Let's actually strike a match just quickly so I might be able to see anything in here. Can't see anything really. It's uh, still way too dark. But that's okay. That, that, that's okay. It's a good start. Uh, freezing our asses off. We don't really have much gear right now. And it's minus 24. Great. Feels like minus 24. Good stuff. Alright. Let's proceed. Now, if you'd ask me where exactly the forest cave is, I would say I don't quite remember. It's been a while since I played. So, in fact, it's been more than half a year since I played uh, The Long Dark and not even... I've not played much back then. I have not been in Pleasant Valley. The lady is uh, freezing her ass off, so... We're gonna need to make a fire of sorts very soon. Wait for uh, the day to maybe bring us some more heat. So maybe if I just pick up some sticks and make a fire in that cave, that will keep us warm for a while. Rather than trying to go out there and trying to fight, find something where we could stay right now. Now... To be honest, I don't remember that cave in uh, the Pleasant Valley, to be honest. You guys must say, Coco, what is wrong with you? How can you not remember that? Well, I don't remember Jesus it. Is cold. Oh, see, she agrees. It's Jesus cold. Let's make a fire. Uh, uh, uh. What are we missing? Need Tinder. Okay. Well, we're gonna make Tinder. No worries. Easy mode. Oh, the crafting is slightly different now, doesn't it? Slightly different. We're freezing our ass off right away. Too cold. Shh, it's okay, lady. It's okay. We're gonna start a fire over here. What's our chance? 55%. Great. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. You won't. Come on. Don't fail me. 50-50. Don't fail me. Wasn't the fire usually going the other way around? Yes, it was. Don't say it, don't say it, don't jinx it, don't jinx it. Oh, it's gonna start, it's gonna start. Oh, beautiful. Oh, beautiful. I'll go ahead and add uh, more fuel. We have a couple of sticks. That will do for a bit. Whew. Okay, we got a fire. It's... Still feels like minus 21. That fire is not helpful. Not at all. It's too cold out here. Uh, give me a torch then. 
Let's go check if there's uh, like coal or something like that. Sometimes you can find coal in caves like this. Coal would keep us warm. There is no coal in here. Okay, well, we gotta go then. We gotta go. Yes, forest cave. I have noticed that we are an empty forest cave. Alright, let's get out of here then. If we are in a forest cave, let's get out of the forest. And let's get somewhere where there's something else in the cave, you know? And uh, you're not gonna freeze your ass off. Where's that gonna be? Who knows? As I said, it's been a while since I uh, played over here. You know what? That makes it even more interesting for me. I uh, hear... So where are those guys? There's a corpse over there. Must be a corpse if these guys are chilling over there. Pick up the sticks as you go. Let's go check uh, where these guys are chilling. Ooh, corpse with a cartridge. Tell me you got a... Nothing, huh? Well, let's go back down. So I hear the river. Does that mean we are... We're somewhere. You know what? I'm not gonna even try to presume where we are. Because... I don't know. I do not know. And that's fine. I'm fine with that. It's been... I have not played much of the Long Dark in the last year. Probably two. So not knowing things like that, it's kind of cool. Uh, does that mean that up top right there is gonna be... Hmm. You know what? Let's go down here. I think I know where I am. Further up top would be that... Like, not satellite, but something like that. Which means that if this is the river that crosses the map, if we go down here, down here, yeah, that's the bridge right there, okay. I know where we are, roughly. We should be able to get to the farm if you continue going that way. Good, oh look, there's rabbits. Frostbite risk, yeah, that happens. We're gonna, we're gonna pick up some rose hips. We're gonna make some tea, you know? Freezing our ass off. Let's stop and pick up some, uh berries you know why not rose hips I'm sorry it's not berries it's different and I'm not gonna go hunt rabbits right now we don't have time for that unless I can throw my torch at them I have a torch you silly billies anything over here no got a weapon we got a stone it's a weapon it's perfect now take the stone Throw it at a rabbit. Stop shaking. Almost did it. That's fine. I think there's a, a house-ish over there as well. There it is. But that one isn't like indoors. It's not enclosed. Which means uh, we wouldn't really be getting any heat there. So we're not gonna go in there. Okay, okay. Uh, it feels like there's new forest noises in this game. Which is kind of cool, kind of creepy, but kind of cool. And we're we're not freezing too badly, so this is fine. Especially since we are getting our ass, we're getting our asses to the main place of this valley. Unless that has been changed, I don't know, but I doubt it. Like the farmhouse was the main attraction of this valley for a long time, so if that was changed, it would be slightly weird. I think I see a house over there. I saw a roof. So maybe there's been some changes. Maybe the farmhouse got some neighbors or something like that. Who knows? We're gonna be picking up all the sticks and stones as we go. Well, mostly sticks. Don't really care about the stones as much. Hello. It is I. So I think this house has usually been just wrecked. Or there might not have been a house over here at all. That's the farmhouse. Yeah, I don't think this house was here before. I do not think this house was here before. Or this barn. Okay. Let's get our asses indoors. And uh, let's see. The temperature feels like minus five. We're getting there, boys. We're getting there. Get some wood. 
Now, you can't just start a campfire indoors. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this one is new. Looks pretty freaking cool as well. Detailed. Ooh. Saws only. We have a fire barrel over here so we could start that and keep us warm. But I think I'm gonna push onwards. Oh, flare and more firewood. Tinder plugin. Uh, what was that? There was something else over here. Wheel. Need a hatchet. I heard noises. <laughs> I was waiting. Now, first aid kit. Let's check that bad boy out. Purifying pills, sure. Ooh, revolver cartridge. Don't mind if I do. I've not actually played since the revolver update, so I've not played with it. So that would, that would be fun to find. Island gardens for island people. Grow local. Yeah, I don't think you grow much over here where there's, everything's like frozen and shit. Anyway, onwards to glory. Let's take the tractor with us, shall we? Let's go in. Hello. Sounds like somebody's walking out there. Could it be just a rabbit? Or could it be we already have wolvesies around? Because there's always like wolves out here. Oh. Be sneaky. No need to be sneaky. I think we have a straight shot over there. There's no wolvesies out here. There seems to be a new house up there on the hill as well. Cool. Alright, let's make it to our new home. Uh, I think that fence is new over there. Potentially. Maybe. Who knows? I think it is new. Pleasant Valley Farmstead. How about that? That is... Oh yeah, you see that, that tower up there? Yeah, that's the one I was talking about earlier. Maybe this fence was not new. I don't know. We should go get ourselves uh, warmed up. That wouldn't be a, a stupid idea. There's nothing in the barn. Feels like there's another house up there that wasn't there before. Maybe some more debris around. This kid's playground. I'm pretty sure that's new. And this fire barrel is also new. Ooh, accelerant. Nobody needs this anymore. Don't mind if I do. Uh, shall we pop in and down below first? How warm is in here? Oh, it is actually warm enough, huh? Feels like zero degrees. Woo, warming up. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. I'll take the cloth. Could rip apart the cardboard box, but I don't think that's really needed quite yet. Uh, new sprints, we'll take that. This uh, below ground is different, I think, as well. And if I saw correctly, there's actually there's actually door, uh, yeah, door up top now, which is kind of cool. Some planks over here, more cardboard boxes we could use for Tinder. Is that some sort of safe? It's a different safe than what usually there was. You can't open it apparently. Gauntlets. Wood matches. Quality tools, huh? If you want to do some uh, crafting. We well, might have to do some crafting. I mean, it's usually cool if you do some of that. Now, I don't know uh, how long this series is going to be lasting. Uh, it basically depends on how long can we survive and how long you guys want to watch this. That's basically how it is. Give me some clothing. No clothing, huh? This work pants I'll take for sure. For sure. The frozen angler, we got our first book. Oh, whetstone. Yeah, that's definitely, definitely very much worth it. Beef jerky. I'll take that. What is this? Just some books? Books of nothing? Oh! Nothing there. We have a workbench over here. And I feel like there's some scrap metal down below. I think we could uh, leave our quality tools down here. Let's draw those. And let's put them up here. There you go. 
Like if we need stuff, we're gonna we're gonna have it here. If you need it for crafting, wool too. Definitely taking that. I should probably put the clothes on. Probably, because we are still like feels like zero degrees, you know. We're that. Uh, we have gauntlets that are probably better. Definitely for protection's sake. That and we have we have work boots right now, and we have the trail boots. I think the trail boots might be better if the quality was better. Maybe not. I'm not sure. But uh, it feels like three degrees now, so we should be heating up. Very nice. Chairs and tables, and that's about it over here, is it? Where's this light coming from? It's like from up top somewhere. It's okay. That's okay. This is a solid start getting straight here. Leave the basement. Yeah, looks like this leads inside in the house now. This was nothing before. Very cool. Search the backpack. Sardines. I wonder where they're gonna be allowing us to actually wear the backpack on our back. That would be kind of cool. Alright, as is tradition, grab all the toilet water. If something Project Zomboid and the Long Dark has taught me. Toilet water, very important. More socks, that's a sewing kit. Good. Very good. Feels like she's very slow at crouching compared to how the things was. Alright, we got uh, Warren Wool Sock and Decent Wool Sock. Wear that. And wear that. Double new socks. Good. What do we have out here? Can opener. Very useful. Oh, it's a gold mine. Any food up top? No. I'm gonna loot this whole house and then we're gonna go through what we actually have and what we actually need. I'm gonna leave the farmhouse quite yet. Imagine finding a gun or something. Note left behind. You could read this. Bread is about two parts flour to one part water. Oh. So this is about making bread, huh? Yeah, fun. We have a cooking pot over here. Got some firewood. How much are we carrying right now? 19 kilos, not so bad. But uh, whenever we get like proper clothing, we're gonna have a ton of proper clothing just, just as part of all of our stuff. Put these things over there. Of uh, our total weight, it's gonna be a lot of it just clothing. If we can, of course, get the clothing before dying to wolves or freezing to death. The metal pail don't need that. Thank you. Teen of sardines. Coffee. Let's go. It feels like the sound is way more crisp as well. It just might be me not playing it for a bit. For a bit. Might be just that. Okay. Uh, what else do we have around here? Still need to go upstairs and we still have... Yeah. Uh, this, this place is huge. Wanna search it? Ski gloves. Those should be gold, actually. No elves on the shelves? Doesn't seem to be. So ski gloves should be... Yeah. Better. Where are those? Good. We need like a park or something like that. We need to find something. Something, something. Something, something park out. Let's go in here first. There's a lot of like glass shards in the floor. I don't, uh, I don't subscribe to that. I don't... Don't like the violence that might have happened over here. Herbal tea. Well, looks like people have not been, been gone for a long time if the herbal tea is still here. Just looking, there's anything underneath. This. There's a book. Any matches up here? Does not appear to be the case. Take that. Nothing else over here, is there? No hidden treasures. Okay, before we go upstairs, we're gonna go search the office area, whatever we want to call this. Let's go. Let's see what we've got. I think we still have uh, 
frostbite risk, don't we? Yeah, hypothermia risk. 45, huh? But we are we are heating up, so this is gonna. Those two are gonna go down. Those two are gonna go down slowly. And hopefully, with the loot we find in here, we're gonna be ready to go out there. Although I kind of doubt it. What do we have over here? Thank you indeed. I think this got a slightly updated model as well. Feels like it. Oh yeah, yeah. The aiming, uh, the aiming thing is also slightly different. Ah, right, right, right. We have one bullet. So that's about it. I like it. All right, holster that bad boy. We have one bullet. If nothing else, we can shoot ourselves. The magnifying lens. That's solid. If you want to start fires outdoors, getting some books as well. Not so bad. Uh, search this. Police. Nothing in here. Anything in here? No. If you didn't know, uh, in this game, you cannot jump, by the way, so traversing stuff, you can't go like Skyrim-like, which is it's fine. Sometimes it's frustrating that you can't jump because you can get stuck on like one tiny rock, but that has been kind of polished over the years, so it's all good. Now, we're not really tired, we're not really hungry yet, we're not really thirsty yet, it's all good. So good in the hood. Usually, weren't there like uh, toy trucks and such kid stuff on the floor over here? Maybe that has changed with the new update. Uh, I see some gear over here. Well, this stuff will come in handy. Isn't that like one of the best coats? Marish P coat? Not the warmest coat out there, but close to it. Does a good job of blocking the wind, but gets very heavy and wet. Stylish. Yo, I think this is like one of the bestest ones, isn't it? It's got really good protection and it definitely looks stylish. Oh yeah. Feels like 10 degrees now, huh? How about that? That was a really good find. I must admit that was a really good find. I like it. Okay, okay. Anything else for us? I do want to pop outside for a bit before... Uh, before we end the day, definitely. Wanna go check if there's really a new house up on the ridge. Or if that house was always there, I just never checked for it. Okay, these wool socks are not very good. We're gonna rip them apart, we're gonna make them into useful stuff, as is tradition. Maybe, you know, keep some extra, because you never know when a wolf's gonna come and wreck your stuff up. Requires a hatchet, yeah. That's a, that was a TV. Dude, who was wild enough over here to drop a TV on the ground, huh? Was that really necessary to wreck havoc like that? Don't like that. Soda and a firearm. Cleaning kit. I mean, sure, we have a firearm. One bullet, but hey. We got that. Oh, that was used to be... That was used to be called... Rifle cleaning kit, and since they added a pistol or a revolver, I guess now it's a firearm cleaning kit. That makes sense. Nothing else over here. We have two bedrooms yet to check, or a toilet in the bedroom, a toilet in the bedroom. Right, that's good. More sports socks. Uh, we're not gonna break this down quite yet. There's a bandage over yonder, a sewing kit. Why do we have a sprain wrist? Because we are carrying too much. I think we are slightly over encumbered. Is that how it is? Yeah. Interesting. Was that always the case? I mean, I know it wasn't the case. Uh, you wanna go up? Yeah. I know it wasn't always the case, but it has been, this been the case since they added like the sprain warnings. Okay. The whole house has almost been looted. Just one more room. And then we are good to do some loot sorting before we go out there once again. Empty, empty. Okay. I think hidden. 
below. There was definitely a bed in here. Is there a bed in here now? Yeah, there's just that master bedroom, but that's about it. Yeah, this was a kid kid's bed, wasn't it? I'm pretty freaking sure. So they definitely changed that. Yes, the they evacuated the kids early. It's good. Okay. We got a bunch of loot. Feels good. Let's use this uh, cabinet maybe to store some of the stuff. That we don't necessarily need right away. Like that. Like the rose hips. We now keep the fire stuff on us. Rifle cleaning kit can go. That can go. That can go. That can go. Uh, food we're gonna keep on us. We now drop the extra socks that we not are we're not wearing right now. So that's gonna alleviate some of the pressure. Put those things in there. Uh, ski gloves we definitely wanna keep on wearing though. Put the antiseptic in there. Those bad boys. And over here, put that for now. We're not very good at starting fires yet, so yeah, do that. Drop all of these. Don't really want to carry too much. Okay, we're now feeling slightly better. Uh, put on the gloves. Where are those? Thank you. Hypothermia risk is almost gone. We should have waited for a second more. It's at one percent. Frostbite risk is gonna stay a bit longer. That's not much we can do about it. Let's uh, snack on something before we go. Maybe sardines. That's gonna make us uh, happier. All right, let's pop out. Uh, let's actually pop out through this door over here. I think that one leads us to the porch. And there we could find something else. Maybe, maybe, maybe. There's a car nearby as well that we could search, but I do wanna cross that ridge and wanna see if there really is a different house up there. Yeah, this is this is the porch. What do you got in here, boys? Oh, a wool scarf. That will be a start. Better than nothing. Okay, how does it feel like? It feels like four degrees right now. So that's good. How about after we pop out? Here, crows. Minus 12. Pretty freaking cold. Okay, they're just... Uh, just moving. They're just moving past. That's fine. Let's go up there. That's a rock. That's not a house. Why do you have to think that was a house? It's definitely a rock, isn't it? <laughs> but I want to see if the farm fields down the other side of the river has changed at all uh, seems roughly the same seems roughly the same but it's kind of quite foggy so it's hard to see let us go down here and let's uh, maybe get some food any food over here no cattails no cattails that's a shame how about over here? Doesn't appear to be the case. Now we do have a rifle, but I will definitely not be holding the rifle in my hand. You hold a rifle in your hand, and especially if you point it toward a wolf, he's gonna be like, yeah, I know what that stick does. I will run straight at you and you will have a very hard time shooting me. Look, there's a deer over there. They're also not hunting a deer. It is getting foggier by the second this expedition might not be the best it is midday though so this this is definitely not the time to be foggy not nice of you game not nice all right let's check this bad boy out there's, I don't know if there's usually anything around here could be like some snow but no okay there's a barn or used to be a barn down this way we're gonna go check that bad boy out tractor down there sorts and there is a lot of bales of hay that's about it why does it have to be foggy I wanted to like 
you know, see the new stuff. See all the new stuff. Now, the loading screen shows us, like, a, a small town. Kinda. Actually, where is the barn? Should we, we not be seeing the barn now? By now? Huh. No, no, no. Uh, any case, uh, it shows us, like, a small town. So, I don't know where that would be on the map. I have no idea. Because, like, the other thing was there was, like, a couple of houses in that direction, roughly. Oh, I think that down there is a barn. And there was a house out there, roughly. So, yeah. Whoa, you jumped like this was five meters. Jesus. That house there is new. For damn certain it is new. There's more than one. That might be it. That might be it. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go check the barn first. And... Uh, in the next episode, we're gonna go check that place. I mean, it is called Crossroads Elegy, so... I'm guessing that is the crossroads. Okay, the barn is not the barn that I remember. Yeah, I thought there was a barn, like, over here in the middle. And it was a closed-off barn. This is not a closed-off barn. There used to be a house down there as well. So maybe there is that. Still out there? I don't know. Okay. Alright, alright. Some cloth over here. Firewood and rifle ammo. Hoo-hoo. Let's go. She's probably very cold, poor lady. Nice, nice, nice. We got a bunch of shots now. If you needed that. Alright, well, for now, thank you everybody for watching. I do hope you enjoyed this first episode. We're gonna continue playing a bit longer. And uh, we're gonna go check out that crossroads town or whatever it is. For now, though, thank you everybody for watching. And uh, if you're new to the channel, click that notification bell below uh, to be notified when the new episodes go live. Otherwise, the episode of this will be going on live every day at 8 p.m. Century European and Summertime from now on. Which is actually gonna change into Century European or just time soon. Uh, actually next week. But for now though, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Go crowd.